So this is part two of the uh, bullet effect. Now, uh, I think most of you have probably worked out how to do this, uh, especially if you've been following me. But if you haven't, that's okay. Uh, so here what we need to do is we need to change the uh, perspective to suit the angle of whatever it is that you're hitting. And to do that, we change that with these green nodes, which are your perspective nodes. And it's just a matter of just uh, moving it to the point where you think that it is that in alignment of whatever it is that you're shooting at. And I think for me that should do it. I'm not going to be 100% perfect with this. Uh, it's, a, it's a tutorial. I just want to get through the tutorial so I'm not going to bore you to death. And I'm just going to move it into position where I want it. And then... I'll resize it. If I resize it first and then try to change the perspective, as you can see those big yellow boxes, it's going to make that impossible. Like and there's my bullet hole. Now what's really going to sell the effect is uh, sound. The sound of the gun is what's going to sell the effect. So I'm going to bring in a gunshot, put then my music track. And then, as you will see, if I press play, there it is. Now, obviously, you do need to make the bullet hole last as long as your footage, otherwise, it will disappear and that will break the illusion. Uh, leave it on as long as you are showing your footage. Now, um, you're probably wondering, well, yeah, that's all well and true, but uh, I don't have uh, the sound of a gun. That's okay, I can show you where you can get that. There's uh, two sorry, two places you can get this. Uh, Sounddog.com. Now, unfortunately, this is not a free site. You will need to be a member here to download uh, all the effects. And if, you, if you're familiar with Free Recorder, uh, you, they've blocked it so you can't record off the screen. So there's no way getting around it unless you put a microphone next to your speaker, which is going to... Not sound good, but uh, if you're if you're stingy like me, then uh, you go to free play music, and it's basically the same thing. You just type in the word bullet, and then everything comes up relating to the word bullet. And honestly, I use this the most, and the only reason is because it's free, <laughs> and that to me is good. Okay, so let's go back to video studio, and realistically. Um, yeah, we're basically done. There's nothing more to really add to it other than, uh, well, you know what? Let's <laughs> let's just corny it up a bit. Uh, I'm going to put a shell casing flying through the air, you know, to really sell the illusion. <laughs> As if. I'm just going to bring my, adjust, my color adjustment down so this is nice. Well, not that much because I've got it. A bit of the black is coming through. Uh, that looks cleaner. Uh, and that's it. Uh, also, I'm going to bring the static down. I don't want it to sit here and tumble for two seconds. That should do it. Let's have a look at my corny effect. <laughs> and there you go. Awesome. It's just mind-boggling stuff, isn't it? Uh, and that's it, folks. We're all done here. But uh, I tell you what, um, <laughs> if I get more than say I don't know, ten comments, ten comments on my video clip, uh, good or bad, I don't really mind. <laughs> and there's, I'm not a comment whore. Uh, it's just that this gives me the impression that hey, people are actually watching it rather than clicking it on by accident and then just saying, oh, I don't want to watch this crap and move on. And if you do, if I do get 10, 10 comments, I will upload uh, that corny uh, effect. I'll upload the gunshot. Uh, I'll even upload the PSD file, the source file, so you don't have to make <laughs> the bullet yourself uh, to a file share, and then I'll put the link in the uh, description. and That just might save you a little bit of time. Okay, so uh, as always, thanks for watching.